Thomas Moore College is hosting the first collegiate rosary rally in the country tonight. Hundreds of students came to pray in honor of a student who died last week. Mitch Kramer was killed in an ATV accident. Local 12's Brad Underwood joins us live from the Crestview Hills campus where there was a large turnout tonight. Brad. There was. Good evening, Paula. Close to a thousand people filled uh, the stadium seats inside uh, the football stadium here on the campus of Thomas More College. You had hundreds of students. You had uh, students representing every single athletic team that uh, is here on campus, as well as the entire football team. There were also residents from several different communities in northern Kentucky. And the family of Mitch Kramer was here. His mother, his father sat in the first row with the president of Thomas More College. Now, they were all here tonight praying the rosary, which is a Catholic tradition centuries old, uh, saying words of scripture. They were praying tonight for a safe and successful school year. They were praying for each other, and of course, they were praying for Mitch Kramer and his family. Kramer died nearly a week ago after an ATV accident. Not much uh, about the accident has been released by police. First responders found Kramer near an ATV on Rifle Ridge Road at about 2.30 last Monday morning. Kramer was a junior here at Thomas More. He was a biology major, and he was a member of the football team. For us to get together right now is very important, and uh, I think it's really great, and it's definitely a good way to remember him. Obviously, young people should never have to go through this, and a family should never have to bury their young child. But together, them coming together has been inspiring for all of us. Now, as we mentioned, you know, this is the first type of event uh, held at a college or university. This type of rally, this rosary rally, we're told, very common with high schools, uh, Catholic high schools across the country. But again, uh, according to Thomas More, never seeing anything like this on a collegiate level. We're also told that this event has been planned for weeks. But obviously, with the incident that happened earlier this week and the passing of Mitch Kramer, certainly adding... Uh, another element, another level of prayer here for everyone in attendance. Reporting live tonight at Thomas More College, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. Paula. Looked like a very moving, moving ceremony or event tonight. Thank you, Brad. And we have more on this. A scholarship fund has been set up in Mitch Kramer's honor. Now, as part of that, this Wednesday, participating Tri-State Buffalo Wild Wings locations will donate 10% of food sales to the fund. That's going to be from 11 to 11.